Apfel Dr. Germany, my name is Ben. Hello and welcome to the micro soldering show. And this time we really have a micro soldering work here. Um, yeah, we got an iPhone 7 Plus. Um, customer um, brought it uh, an hour uh, before. And um, the problem is, David already dismounted the board. Um, it doesn't start at all. And when I get it to the DC power supply and um, uh, press on start on the high power and uh, the, the board should boot then I get 1.5 amps so I think um, could be PP3VO NAND error shorted cap on PP3VO NAND I didn't have a look so uh, we will do it together now so when I get it on here directory 1.5 amps okay let's have a look uh, at the thermal camera and see what what the thermal cam tells us okay so let's have a look let's have a look what the camera does. I'm really tired today because my son my youngest son Frido gets teeth at the moment and he was awake tonight so I was awake too let's have a look what happens here and like I said it's really amazing I just know about things like that when I just see the numbers on DC power supply you see that 1.5 amps cap next beside to the end directly on the point okay so let's see let's see how fast we can fix that error David ich habe dir ähm, ein Gerät dahingestellt genau richtig wenn du fertig bist einmal rüber zu mir Kannst du nur, du, dann gib mir es, dann mach ich es gleich. Auch kein Problem. Ja, ist gar kein Problem, stell es mir nochmal hin. Dann mach ich es fertig. So, okay, thanks. Good. You should see the terminal in the video. I will add it as source. And now we can just have a look together under the microscope. under the microscope and see what we got there take them take them with you any that's no problem I take something other okay so let's just see around uh, what's under directly under the underfill see we just get it free why do we get it free because I want to see again under the thermal I think it's right this cap yeah it is okay I just wanted to see again so I don't take a cap out uh, which is not shorted but it's right this cap okay so let's just get it out take some hot air get rid of this underfill and then just gently gently get this cap out okay We 
don't want to lose pets. You see? Pets are there. Cap is out. So, now we just take our tweezers to clean the area. Nice. And then we get a new cap in. Okay. So, just a little bit of flux. Then we can clean these pads. Great, not too much. Then clean, a little bit of contact cleaner, and then we take a new cap and get it in right to that point. And then the phone should boot again normally, and the customer should have all his important data. Just one cap at 3 way on end, shorted, I often see that, often saw these NAND cap damages in the last years. And you see, we are done. Looks amazing. I like these caps. 0402, so not small. A big cap on 3 vo NAND. Let's have a look what our DC power supply tells us and if the phone is booting again, if the, if, if the board wants to work again. So, let's give a screen here to me. Screen out of the box. Get it on the board. And then we just get the cable on. And now let's see what happens if we put the device. Bam! We should see an apple and we see... Clean the screen. And in a minute we should see that the device is fully working again I will assemble the device clean the board get the clue back on the housing get the screen back in and the device can be taken off by the customer and she got all her import, important it's a wife it's a it's a wife okay she got all her important data on it okay you see just works iPhone 7 plus fast repair 
just a little short on PP3VO NAND and the phone is without any function. If you want to learn things like that, you can do that on the board level Repair School Germany. If you are working at the repair industry for smartphones, you can join our Facebook group Smartphone Repair Group Germany. I'm out. We see us with the next video. Yours, Ben. Goodbye.